Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Alan. We jumping right into a vertical smoker on here. Already had the chamber and stuff put together, getting it welded out now. This is the smaller one, one of the 20 by 20 verticals. One that I use a whole lot of in videos and stuff. I'm actually finna fire one up today and do some pork shoulder. Here I'm just getting the doors going, getting them framed in, then gonna cut the vents into it. Drilling pilot holes in it here for the vents. That way the uh, circle burner will have something to sit in. I've been using that uh, uh, titanium plasma and you can't, it just does not like the bottom of two pieces at once. So by putting that pilot hole, I can do them individually. Also drilling for the door latch on there. And this is what I mean drilling for the door latch. That's what I'm setting up on there now. And that just about wraps up that door latch. It's a process to get that thing set up. And then the vent. Getting the tables ready. I skipped around a whole lot on these smokers, uh, this one and the, the grill that I'm doing in this video. Just trying to get them done. They're actually both gone now. I'm kind of late getting this video put together. These tables are just about the last part of getting this one done before I clean it up and get it painted.
All right, so we're jumping into the chamber on this grill. It's another 30 by 20 grill. Just putting all the panels together here. One end is clamped down to the table there. Getting the door cut into it. This is just a smoke pipe, getting it cut out. It's a four inch pipe on these. The evolution saw may cut that miter, but I'm not sure, but I try to keep it out of that saw as much as possible so it don't eat the blade up as fast. It will cut it just straight. I think it cuts up to a six inch straight. Just wrapping it all up. I'm getting the door put on here. Like I say, I skipped around a lot on these. This 30 by 20 is built with 316 steel. It's, <clears throat> it's still 550 without the door clamps. If you want the door clamps, it's 600. You really don't need them. The weight of the door is kind of holding down on that gasket. But a lot of people still like to add them. I'm just about ready to paint this one now. And anybody looking to order some grills or smokers, you can email me. I'll put it up in the description box. I'm a few months out on the orders right now, but it's best to go ahead and get on the list because it just gets longer and longer. The 20 by 20 vertical smoker, it's 950 built with quarter inch. Here we'll take a look at them. This is the main one I've been using lately. This diverter plate right here, I just take it out and leave that water pan on the rack where it's at. And man, I, I just love it like that. I still leave the diverter plate in for some people that might want it, but it's really not necessary in there. That water pan, that water pan does everything you need it to do right there. Here's the grill. And that'll just about do it on this one, y'all. Like I say, if you're uh, looking for a grill or a smoker, shoot me an email. And if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. And we'll see y'all on the next one. I'm working on another one right now with a trailer. So we'll see y'all whenever I get that one done. I got a video coming too, showing where I'm putting the shop at. I got the shop coming here real soon. Should be getting started in the next week or so. 
So anyway, if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one.